Oh my god, my novel's gone! Welcome to Patrol Tech. I'm Tech 1. And I'm Tech 2. The hair or the beard? Pick one. We've all accidentally toasted a file or folder we didn't mean to. But as the good book says, don't panic. The good news is, on most Windows computers, recovering your files may be as easy as a few clicks. Today we're going to talk to you about the Previous Versions tab. On your personal Windows devices, this is made possible by System Restore, and on Windows Server this is made possible by Volume Shadow Copy, or VFS for short. More nerdy details and some Microsoft FAQs in the doobly-doo. The first thing is remembering where your file or folder was before it disappeared. You're going to want to navigate to that place. In this example, we'll be going to a folder on the desktop called Important, which contains a subfolder called My Novel within which was the file we deleted in the intro. So all we have to do here is right click any blank spot inside the folder and go to properties in the context menu. And when that properties window pops up, go to the tab up top that says previous versions. Now if you don't see that tab, then previous versions is probably not enabled for that location. And if you have the tab and that area labeled folder versions is blank, then that means there are no previous versions saved. This is a reminder that previous versions is not a backup solution. Just a quick place to check before pulling your hair out. If you do have versions available, notice that the dates and times of these backups are labeled. The second thing you need to know about these files is when they were last here. So, for example, if we deleted the files on the 8th, we want to pick the closest version date before the files were deleted. Another thing you may be wondering as you notice the dates, the backups, or snapshots, always happen periodically. In this case, this server location is scheduled backups at 7 a.m. and noon, but this laptop has dates and times all over the place. So what if you create and delete a file within this window? Say I created a file at 8 a.m. and deleted it at 11 a.m. Oh, then you're really up the creek. Up the creek, for the uninitiated, means Hey, you can't say that on TV. We're not on TV, this is the internet. Yeah. Who cares? Yeah! Remember, the only way to be safe is multiple backups and multiple locations. And remember, flash drives are not reliable media. They're this generation's floppy disks. And like the name suggests, they can fail or they can get lost in a flash. That was awful. I went there. Well, if you have episode ideas or comments, please let us know. Facebook, Twitter, or in the comments below. Thanks for watching. And be sure to catch us next time when we show you how to recharge any mobile device with a potato battery and a mechanical pencil. Special thanks to George Vieira for suggesting that we get a new background. What did you have in mind, George? Leave your suggestions in the comments below. And also a shout out to Jeff Ramage for sending Tech2 a link on how he should pronounce Compass via our Facebook page. Compass. Compass. That's what I say. If you do have a versions tab available, notice the dates and times on the things. You got a little girl here on you here. Let me, let me get rid of that oh, for you. Yeah. Like the name suggests, they can fail or get lost and pause and <laughs> you can do that again. Something different? Okay, yep. Yeah. That gets deleted.